Welcome everybody out there in YouTube land for a long anticipated spider video. I know I haven't done one for a while, but we're going to do one today. This is going to be a transfer video for a book of theory or nada, which I have right here. Um, it's just a regular deli container you get from Giant Eagle or Pick and Save or Metro Market or wherever you happen to have in your area, depending on if you're in the Northeast or Midwest or wherever you might be. Um, she just molted, he or she, I'm not sure, just molted on Thursday. Today is Sunday. So, this is the new enclosure. These you get obviously at Walmart. They're about $2.97 a piece. Uh, drill some holes in the top for air and everything else. Put some cork bark substrate and a water dish if you choose so. I have not done a water dish as of yet because I don't know if he's actually big enough. Now, here's the plan. Um, the deli container fits perfectly on top of this, like so. We're not going to do the transfer upside down. We're going to turn it to the side. However, just to give a demonstration. Now, what I'm going to end up doing is um, putting a hole at the bottom, as you can see I did with this cup right there, just as, um, you know, a test. So I need to carefully turn this to the side without disturbing the spider. Cut a little slit down here with this somehow very carefully. Then uh, take paintbrush, put this on top of the new enclosure sideways, whatever, take the paintbrush, put it in the hole, find the spider, and coax him out until he gets into the new home. And then once he's in the new home, lid on top and there you go. One happy spider. So that's the plan. That way I don't have to actually worry about him escaping or anything else. So we're going to see how this goes. I don't know how it will go. However, um, wish me luck. I don't know. I'll have a catch cup just in case. So, all right, let's get started. All right, guys, uh, as you can see, I've carefully slit a very small hole right there, um, which is big enough to get the paintbrush into. It'll be a little bit of a tight squeeze, but I should be able to get it in there. I'm um, probably going to try and open it a little bit more. Just a hair. Without disturbing the spider. Can you see me? No, you can't. Okay, now you can. All right, that should be good. Now, as you can see, I have the new enclosure here. Uh, the Ornata is already trying to crawl up a little bit, so we're gonna take this cover off, uh, line it up with this, put it on that, put the paintbrush in there, get the spider out, and cover them up. Should be pretty simple, I believe. Like I said, I do have a kitchen cup somewhere right here which I shall probably not need, but I guess you never know. Hopefully you'll be able to see this, um, it's moving. So, let's get this started. As you can see, perfect fit. Spider is right there. I don't know if you'll be able to see or not. I'm actually going to start with this. So, spider's up on top there. He's not turning yet. to take a while. I think he's trying to attack the paintbrush. Alright. 
turn around. Just pushing the entire, the entire piece of cork bark. There we go. Okay, he's in. All right, he's in the new enclosure. There we go. So, put that on top, and that went well. Somewhat. There we go. So, there is one Pocatharia ornata right there. I don't know the size on them. Two and a half, three inches, something like that. Not too bad, not too big, neither. But, um, there we go. There it is, one P or not a transfer that went pretty smoothly, uh, just freshly molted on Thursday. Could have gone a lot smoother than it did, but I guess it didn't go too terribly bad. Got a little bit of his old substrate in there and whatnot. Now I got a mess in the bathroom, but I can clean that up. Uh, you probably can't see the mess, but I can turn on this and you will see the mess. See? There's the mess. There's the old cork bark, the old enclosure right here, and a uh, big mess in the bathtub that I got to clean up, but whatever, it's fine. I'll do that. I think he'll be happy in here. He's um, crawling around a little bit, exploring a little, maybe, hopefully. You can't see, there we go. You can see him right there. So I'm going to cut the video off because it's gone on for a little bit long. Uh, he was a little bit frustrated, probably a little bit stressed right now, but I think he'll fit in just fine. Uh, this enclosure might be a little bit too big for him, but he'll grow into it and uh, everything should be good. So without further ado, I'm going to shut the video off and hopefully bring you uh, more spider videos at some point in time soon. Other than that, guys, thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe, and uh, tell me if I did halfway decent on this transfer. All right, thanks for watching again. Hey, guys, just a quick update here. Here's my Ornata, as you can see, um, moving around a little bit. Uh, I don't know the exact size on it. I'm going to guess two and a half. Possibly, you no, know, no, probably not three. It's two and a half. I guess it could be three. But either way, um, there he is. He seems to be doing quite well. Um, he's adjusted to his new home a little bit better, I think. And um, he's probably going to crawl around to the other side of the cork park now. And that's fine. So, explore, explore. But there he is. A little bit better picture uh, of him for you. I'll keep the light on, otherwise you won't be able to see him. So, uh, like I said before, rate, comment, subscribe. And uh, let me know if I did a decent job on the transfer and uh because i really don't know if i did but i think i had a decent idea at least uh for it so in the meantime there you go